kick back and catch a vibe. We at home with Lisa, Lisa. Kick back, it's a lifestyle. We at home with Lisa, Lisa. Kick back and catch a vibe. Hello, everyone. Welcome back to At Home with Lisa, Lisa. Hi, lovebirds. Welcome back to the channel. Hey, y'all. Hey. Today, you all, we are involved in a collaboration that is titled The Fall Tree Decorating Extravaganza. This is an open collaboration that is hosted by Lifestyle Designs with Teresa, The Great Life DIY Home Decor, At Home with Lisa Lisa, and Debbie Bubbles. Now, with this collaboration, all you have to do is decorate a fall tree or trees and reveal. Now, if you are to create a video, please make sure you hashtag fall tree 24. So you guys, I have never done a fall tree before. So I was thinking, what in the world can I do? So I decided to pull out, as you can see, my slim tree or my skinny tree. And I think it's a seven and a half foot skinny tree. So as you can see, I am trying to pull the limbs out. You all know this is the most tedious part of a tree once you pull it out from it being in the box from year after year. So that's what I am doing. So also too, I do believe I am going to create a sunflower themed fall tree. Yeah, that sounds good. I think that's what I'm going to do. So I'm excited to see how this is going to turn out. If this is your first time here, we welcome you with open arms. If you're returning, welcome back. We're so happy to have you because y'all already know we cannot do this without you. And then we wanna welcome all of our new love bugs to the channel. So I'm going to stop chit chatting. I want you to grab your drink and grab your snack. Sit back because we're going for a little ride on this one, y'all. I want y'all to be patient and trust the process.
so now that we're all fluffed out we are going to use this beautiful sunflower ribbon and we're going to attach it to the tree we're going to make some loops on here and i think it's going to be beautiful and i like to go ahead and put my uh, ribbon on first and that way i know where i have to fill everything else that i'm going to use i hope you guys are enjoying this video thus far i hope by now you have considered giving me a big thumbs up and also by the time you reach the end of this video if you're not a love bug i hope that you have subscribed to the channel so you know every time we bring content to you to the second part of decorating this skinny tree now I'm just making a bow by hand I'm going to make several by hand look at my hey little hey girl hey I'm going to make several by hand and I'm going to add them throughout the tree and yes you guys continue to keep watching as I make these beautiful bows and I'm going to just do one tail on them I'm not doing two because this is a skinny tree and I don't want too much going on on this tree.
and the um, garland to the tree it's very simple all you do is use your branches to secure all of that to your tree so that's all I did was I just used the branches to be able to hold them in place just going to add some florals to the tree to spruce it up and to make it look full and y'all I'm using the yellow sunflowers and the white sunflowers as well too I thought that would be a nice touch to the tree since I was using the sunflower ribbon and you guys that that ribbon is gonna last me for some time now this is like my uh, I think second time using it I had purchased it from Sam's last year and it is like I think it's like 10 yards it's a lot it's some real good um, sturdy thick ribbon and I love it I can't remember the price but I re do remember it was half off of whatever the price was so yeah you guys
So basic, basically, I purchased these bundles from the Dollar Tree and instead of me just using the one bundle and stuffing it in the tree, what I did was I just clipped each one, um, each stem off to be able to have more. So I think I purchased like eight bundles to be able to use in this tree to make it full. love bugs here we are we are here at the reveal now i know some of you guys probably remember me making this bow but if you didn't go back and check out that video where i created some fall diy bows so this one is my tree topper but let's check out this skinny sunflower galore fall tree that I have created. I had fun doing it um, because I was creating and thinking of what I was going to do as I was doing it. So yeah, you guys, I like the way the pumpkins are just sitting in there and I love how all of the floral stems are stuffed in the tree. I like the way the handmade bows look in there as well too. So I think it turned out pretty good. I don't think it's, you know, it's too bad. I like it. I think I'm going to house it in my office there. But yeah, you guys, just take a look at my skinny tree. Yes, so I think using the sunflowers, I think that was a, um, a nice touch to be able to do that because I have so much of that ribbon. And I hope you guys enjoyed me creating this skinny uh, fall sunflower galore tree for you guys because um, like I said I enjoyed creating it for you and all I used was a skinny tree some ribbon and some florals that's it that's all I used and the only thing that I did purchase was the florals from the Dollar Tree the Dolore tree as I am Shakita D says but yeah you all um Thanks again for tuning in on the video today. And this tree also comes with lights. So in the next clip, you're going to see it with the lights on. It looks really, really nice. I like it. I like it a lot. I like it. I like it a lot, you guys. So here you go. Here are the lights. The lights are on, giving it a beautiful, beautiful statement piece here. I wish I could put it up my stairs on the second flight but there's no um i have no electrical outlet there so i couldn't put it there but it would have looked perfect there but since i have my sunflower lantern in my office already i'm just going to place it in my office so this is not where it's going to stay 
right here is going to be in my office and in the next clip we will see it in my office but it turned out beautiful you guys i love it and i hope you guys like it too and i appreciate each and every one of you for spending time here today i know this video was a little lengthy but it does take time to kind of perfect things the way that you want it to look but anyway at home with lisa lisa is going to sign off and don't forget to go over and check out the other ladies I'm sure you won't be disappointed at what they're creating on their channels today. And if you want to, if it's your first time going over, just let them know that At Home with Lisa Lisa sent you guys over there. All right, love bugs, At Home with Lisa Lisa is signing off. And I'm going to see you all in the next video. Bye bye, love bugs. See y'all in the next. And catch a vibe We at home With Lisa, Lisa Kick back It's a lifestyle We at home With Lisa, Lisa Kick back And catch a vibe